more for the road. Keep both cold and wet. Who knew? Not for me. Curfew's in 20 minutes. Sun's going down even quicker, and the last thing I want to do is spend the night in a Cylon jail cell. Cylons show up to help us. First thing they do is build a jail. Mm, he's so beautiful. You two should have one. We're working on that. <laughs> okay. Great work if you can get it. <laughs> Thanks, bye. Bye, be safe. We need to find you a lady, buddy. You're starting to walk funny. <laughs> hey, if Nora has a sister, I'm there. Sorry, I can't help you. <sighs> Story of my life. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. We, uh, we quit. Mm -hmm. We're gonna have a baby. We've got to clean up our act. Mm -hmm. You, uh, you hear about Longo? No, what? Toaster's got him. Found his weapon stash. You think Duck will bite? Jammer's finding out right now. This silence didn't get them all. Longo had these hidden under his latrine. This is all that's left? This is fracking pathetic. If this keeps up, we'll have nothing but rocks left to throw at the bastards. Yeah, nobody to throw them. They shot him in cold blood? <sighs> Toaster's claim when they found his stash, he was reaching for his gun. What? Charlie's not that stupid. Those frackers murdered him. God, it's poor Charlie. Hiding weapons in his tent? What does he expect? And now they want us to do their dirty work for them. Are you kidding me? New Caprica police? What a bunch of crap. Some people say it's a good thing. <laughs> Get the Centurions off the streets, let us patrol them ourselves. Maybe Charlie would still be alive oh, no, no, if they had no, human. No. no matter how you try to swing this, you work for the toasters, it's treason. That's it. Yeah, I forgot my hat back at the Chiefs. I'll see you later. Mm. All right. See you, man. Yeah. What do you think about him being a godfather? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. It's <laughs> bad time. Dom is not going to have a hope in hell getting us off this rock if we don't put together an effective fighting force. We're going to have to keep these here until we find a better hiding place. Colonel, I got a wife, a newborn, I can't... We'll move them as soon as we can. Well? Duck hates the toasters, no doubt about that. He's also an ex-viper jock with 40 kills. Talk to him, make him understand that we need him. Throw in some poetic crap about the struggle for liberty against the Cylon oppressors, whatever it takes. We need more people or this resistance movement is gonna die in its crib. Look, part of me would love to kick some chrome-plated ass with you guys, but it's not gonna happen. I just got other plans. Other plans? What the frick is that? Nora. So what? I got a wife and a kid. You don't think I'll worry about them? What kind of future are we gonna leave if we just lay down and quit? That's just a spineless excuse. The duck's no coward, Chief. He made his choice, we made ours. Let's leave it at that. Frick that. We give thanks for the food you have presented us. May this harvest be spared the blight. So say, so we, say all. we all. So say we all. We picked up all the weapons from the other sites. They're in crates marked machine parts. We'll smuggle them over here a few at a time. Wait a minute. You want to hide firearms in the temple? Something wrong with that? This is sacred ground. The Cylons respect that, which is why they leave the temple alone. And that makes it the perfect hiding place. But it's sacrilege. Well, I'll tell you what. You say a prayer. Ask the gods to forgive us. We move the guns in tonight. If it pleases you, great Aphrodite, grant us a child. If it pleased her, You'd be pregnant already. 
Well, maybe if you came to temple with me once in a while. The gods help those who help themselves. Okay. Why don't you get your butt over here and help me then? <laughs> Jammer and Tyrrell tried to recruit me today. For the resistance? Turn them down. Thank the gods. There was a time when I would have done it in a heartbeat, but I guess things change. How? You. Up all bunks. I thought we left all that military crap aboard Galactica. Well, you're already late. Tyrrell's gonna kick your ass. Here. Mm -hmm. Do you maybe want to meet me at Temple when you get off? No, I don't do temples. That would really mean a lot to me. Mm. I don't need all the bells and whistles. I talk to the gods in my own way. But I'll be there in spirit. I'll see you later tonight. Oh, good. Now go, 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 go. Right. Five more minutes. Five more minutes. You're lucky Galen comes from a religious background. Duck says he believes, but I can never get him in here with me. Galen's having his own crisis of faith. Finding out Brother Cabot was a sideline didn't help. Still, you got him to agree to hold a dedication ceremony to the gods for your son. <laughs> a small miracle. Mm. Well, it's the small ones that keep me going. Or like finding fresh greens for sale? Ah, I got you some. I thought you might be too busy. Oh, thank it's you. It's our temple. What's that? Go back! Infidels! Stand aside! Silence. Some trees really want you here. Must. If you insist! Stand your ground! Wait, my bag! Did she say anything? No. It happened so quickly. She didn't suffer. I should have been there and I should have, I should have been with her. 
she even asked me to go? Well, then there's nothing you could have done. Could have died with her? Well, sometimes the will of the gods is not for Fight her. the gods! The gods killed her! Were there guns at the temple? Doesn't matter. Toasters thought there were. That's not an answer, Chief. Yeah. Go. Go, Miss Lee. Listen. Go! Ten dead, twelve wounded. They shot the temple to shreds. Never dreamed we'd get this lucky. Lucky? The silence are cracking down. They're making random arrests. Well, One thousand people protested outside Colonial One today. Temple massacre pushed people over the edge. The population's with us now. Solved our recruitment problem. More than 150 people joined up in the last three days. A uh, hell of a bargain for a few confiscated weapons. What about the ten innocent people? Why did you tell Duck what a bargain you got for Nora's life? You got that ass backwards, Sonny. We didn't shoot those people. The Chrome Jobs did. Yes, we hid weapons there. Hey, we're not playing patty cake here. These bastards burned up 20 billion of us. You gonna say that's our fault, too? Instead of bawling like a little girl, you should focus on getting some payback. Is that all this is about to you? Blood for blood? We're at war. War is messy. People get killed. Good people. Nice people. Get that through your head or get out. We don't need any crybabies in this outfit. people for the toasters to grab, but it had to be Jammer. That little frack could give us all up. Jammer may be a pain in the ass, but he's no traitor. He's not gonna talk. Well, I hope you're right about him, for all our sakes. This is so fracked up. I'm so completely fracked. Call you James or do you prefer Jammer? You weren't supposed to cough, you're totally unnecessary. I apologize. Are you gonna tell me why I was arrested? You're not under arrest. I brought you here because I wanted to talk about what happened at the temple. All I know about the temple is that you blew ten innocent people to pieces. Yeah. It might be hard for you to believe, but we all feel sick about it. It's uh, tragic. There's no other word for it. The centurions overreacted. But I think if you're honest with yourself, you'll admit that the shooting wasn't entirely our fault. That's bullcrap. We have always left your temple alone. Never dreamed of sending centurions there until someone decided to hide weapons in it. We didn't shoot those people, you did. True. And I accept full responsibility for that. But bringing instruments of death into a house of worship is a sin. Don't you agree?
Think about it, James. Whoever hid those weapons in there must have known we'd catch wind of it. Maybe they even leaked the information to us. Maybe they wanted it to happen. Why? Because some people are afraid of peace. Afraid to stop fighting, afraid of what they might be without it. But you're not one of those people, are you, James? You'd like to put all this bloodshed behind you. Get a place of your own one day, a farm, maybe. A wife, kids, a life. Who wouldn't? Well, it's not impossible. It could happen. It could happen for you, for me, for, for all of us. Wow. Individuals like you and I have to be brave enough to demonstrate that there's a better way. Others are already doing it. That juice comes from farms right here on New Caprica where Cylons and humans are working together, growing things instead of killing each other. The power grid's almost complete, so is the water system, thanks to your engineering teams and ours. And when we can finally have human beings policing the streets instead of centurions, we will... That's what all this is about? You want, me, you want me to join the new Caprica police? That's never gonna happen. I'm not a fracking collaborator. I'm not asking you to be. All I'm asking is that you help me prevent another tragedy like the temple shooting. Well, how am I supposed to do that? Show this at the gate and they'll let you in to see me right away. If you hear of anything that might lead to more bloodshed, get hold of me. Maybe the two of us can find a way to stop more innocent people from being killed. Hey. Hey. How did you know? Boomer told me. What's it like in there anyway? It's pretty rough. Uh, yeah, they had some skin job all over me about the Temple Massacre, the weapons, who, what, where, you know, the usual stuff. Just like you'd expect. And? Well, told him to go frack himself. Good. I would have liked to have seen the look on his face. Yeah. He was one pissed off toaster. There he was. <laughs> Thank you.
with this mark, we dedicate Nicholas Stephen Tyrrell to the service of Ares and Apollo. May he prove worthy of their blessings and those of mighty Zeus. So say we all. So say we all. He's wet again. No, it's okay. It's my turn. Thanks, baby. Chief. that? Join you, Caprica, please. You're gonna work for the toasters after they killed Nora? Some motherfucker obviously told them we were hiding weapons in here. If I join them, maybe I can find out who. It's pretty dangerous. Back to the fight. Thanks, Chief. Hey, Duck. Careful. Yeah. Hey, Chief. And now that we got more people on board, it's time for a major hit on the skin jobs. Anders found us a source for ammonium nitrate. Good. We'll need to find a place to turn it into explosives. I was thinking under the grain storage tent. That's right across from the hospital. If we frack up and that stuff explodes, those patients the are... patients good. will have to take their chances. Right. Okay, I'm go check the perimeter. Glad you quit. What fracking difference does it make now? Take it easy, bro. Yeah. Easy. 